So one of the things I don't hear talked about very much is the primary grind. So there's a lot of the ones about secondary grind and behind the edge thickness, uh, but primary grinds aren't really talked about much. Uh, so there's a, also a difference in terminology. I uh, guess some people say that this is primary and this is secondary, which I'm going to be referring to it as. And then others would go the other way. They'd just call this the primary and this the secondary. So for the video, just for, uh, for reference purposes, uh, this is what I'm referring to as the primary and this is the secondary, at least for this video. Uh, so uh, one thing for this one, this came up because and this is a little bit harder to go through some thicker materials. Uh, so it's a little bit uh, thicker and that degree is different that I found. Uh, so uh, for the BRS, uh, this one is going to be about 10.85 degrees. Uh, so that's going to be inclusive, so both sides. So that's going to be 10.5 or 10.85 degrees. Uh, which works out to be about a 17% um, grade. So if you're driving on the road um, and then you're coming up the hill, that's basically a 17 uh, degree grade uh, for that. Uh, and then also going to be um, where it kind of compared to uh, one that's kind of known for um, the beyond edge thickness, very good, being a really good slicer, uh, is going to be the Manly. Uh, so that's going to be this knife here. So for this purpose, I look at this one and see, okay, well, what is the um, the primary uh, percent here? Uh, so this is going to be the actual degree, sorry, not percent, uh, but the manly is going to be 6.76 degrees, which is about a 12% grade. And then looking at a kitchen knife, so a standard kitchen knife, very cheap, not a great kitchen knife, but the one I had, uh, that one's like a two, a two degree, uh, which is like a 3.4 percent grade and so in looking at different videos online or information they a two percent grade kind of equates to like a headwind if you're running or something uh, so that's where i think that uh, there's maybe too much placed onto the behind edge thickness and not enough placed onto the actual primary uh, bevel as far as uh, this percentage because that's where you, i feel that you're going to feel the most difference between it so this could be a thicker uh, edge here so as you sharpen it, uh, that's going to get thicker and thicker because this is going to be a flat grind. Uh, so that's not going to change the feel as much going through uh, cardboard. Uh, and then that's going to be the same thing for this one. Uh, it's going to have the same um, degree that's going up, the same type of grading that goes up to this, this full um, stock thickness. So as you sharpen it, that will get thicker behind the edge, but then the actual uh, degree uh, will not change all the way to the spine. So that's where I think that's going to make the most difference for it. So let me know as far as what you think about that because that's going to be something I'll be covering more in videos uh, as far as another uh, kind of point of uh, data so you guys can look at and kind of discuss because uh, that's where I think that's going to be the biggest point to it. So really 2% kitchen knife uh, that's going to be I went and run through cardboard with some of that and that yeah that went through very well. Uh, so I would say about 5% is like really like very hard to attain for a pocket knife and probably going to be too thin. And then I would say after that, um, it's going to be maybe about, um, I don't know, maybe 7, 8 is going to be ideal. And then anything below that is going to be really good. Above that's going to be okay. Uh, so that's going to be my thoughts on that. But let me know what you think about that side. But that is the primary grind uh, for a knife.